In this tutorial, we will install Poetry on Windows and use it with the new Crew AI CLI tool to create and set up a new project. To install Poetry on Windows, we must first install pipx. One way to install pipx on Windows is by using pip. We type pi-m pip install dash dash user pipx. This will result in a warning that the installation path is not on the system path. So we copy the given installation path and change to the directory. And inside that directory, we type pipx.exe ensure path, as mentioned in the documentation. This will add the installation location to the system path. To verify the installation, we can check the version of pipx and in our case it's 1.5.0. Now we can use pipx to install poetry on our Windows machine. When the installation is completed, we can check the version of the install poetry, which is in our case version 1.8.2. We can switch to our main project folder, create a directory like crew AI template and change to the directory. From inside the directory, we launch Visual Studio Code. In Visual Studio Code, we first create a virtual environment and then activate the virtual environment. The name of the virtual environment appears before the prompt. In our case, .vnv. The next step is to install Crew AI. We want to install the main Crew AI package and the tools package, which contains some additional tools for our agents. So we copy the line and paste it in the terminal, but get some issues. We just need to do some adjustment to start the installation of the Crew AI package and the dependencies. This will take some time and after the installation is done, the prompt comes back and we can clear the screen. Optionally, we can use pip freeze to list all of the packages and their versions in the requirements.txt file. When we open requirements.txt file and search for crew AI, we see the main crew AI package and the crew AI dash tools in the list. Now that crew AI is installed, we can use the new crew AI CLI command, crew AI create and the name of the project. In our case, my project. This will create the structure of the crew AI project the professional way. We can explore the structure. There is a readme file with some additional information on how to install and run the project using poetry. Next, we have the pyproject.toml file, which has the instruction for the poetry how to set up the virtual environment for the project and install the needed packages. This is a simple setup, but in the coming videos, we will add more instruction in this file, mainly the list of the packages needed for the project. The file structure of a new professional crew AI project is automatically laid out for us. And in the config folder, there are the configuration of the agents and tasks in YAML format. If we need to define our own tool, a template is also provided. In this simple project, we do not need to define a new custom function. In crew.py, we see how the crew AI components come together. Here we can add our custom tool or use tools provided directly by Crew AI. We will show both cases in the coming videos. Finally, in main.py, we will run or in Crew AI terms, kick off the project and provide some input parameters. Here we define, for example, AI LLMs as our topic when we run this project. Crew AI per default connects to OpenAI and uses the GPT-4 model. You can change this behavior and use Olama for local LLMs like Llama3, or you can use Croc for much faster inferences. As this tutorial is more about installing poetry, we can use the default OpenAI, 
but to save some costs, we can define the cheaper model directly here in .env file. Please provide your own API key as I revoked the key before uploading this video. Now we have the blueprint of our project and want to use Poetry to set up our project on our deployment server. You can navigate to the commands section of the Poetry documentation as it has many options and settings. For example, you can search for lock or install as we will use these commands in our deployment server to set up the project. To simulate a deployment, we copy the folder of our project and put it in another folder like Poetry. Now we open the project folder in the new location using Visual Studio Code. Here we do not have any virtual environment already set up. So we open the pyproject.toml file in the root of the project. As mentioned, this file has the instruction for Poetry how to set up the project. We open the terminal and first type Poetry lock. A virtual environment is created in app data and a snapshot of the current packages and the dependencies are created in the lock file. Next, we install the packages. This will take some time. When the installation of the packages is done, we get a confirmation message with the project name. So we can finally enter the command poetry run and the name of the project. In this case, my project. This will take the parameter we hard coded in the main.py file and kick off the crew. After a while, we will get the answer from crew AI. And now we have a starting point to build more sophisticated crew. To wrap it up, we can use Poetry and the Crew AI CLI command to create and set up Crew AI projects based on the recommended structure. This is a more professional and future proof way to set up Crew AI projects. Good luck setting up Crew AI projects using the new way.